Hi guys, this is task number three. So Dax Fit is a profession which has both specialist PT courses and professional coaches uh, to coach clients um, to achieve their own goals themselves rather than placing the goals upon them. Um, so functionally intelligent transformations, I guess to me, um, this sort of emphasises looking at a client or an individual as a whole, so looking um, at their body um, and their mind, um, their life, their connections, their relationships, business, everything involved and trying to sort of map out what's going on, um, I guess, from an outside perspective. So what you, what you do, what, the, uh, what you guys do is something called um, the Kinetic Chain Assessment, uh, which is a complete diagnostic program to sort of get an understanding of the bodily functions. Um, and, and this therefore uh, melts down to the three maps, um, the body map, so the... Um, talking about the body, the biomap, the digestive and hormonal functions, and also the mind map, um, looking at the brain. Um, it all, all interlinks really quite clearly and quite cleverly as well. Um, um, they, are three un they are three unique um, core foundations which assess and address threat, um, both from uh, psychological, physiological, uh, digestive and hormonal perspectives. So... I guess the aim uh, aim of the game is to create a strategy um, through mapping uh, to try and switch off both internal and external um, threats that may be causing issues um, and therefore lead to reactive and compulsive behaviours within a client. Um, and we need to all, we need to address uh, what it what is causing the threat so that we can have optimal bodily function. I guess. Um, there's uh, something which is really sort of looked into and highlighted, and uh, is that the fight, flight or freeze uh, response um, to perceived threat. This is sort of, you know, the main, the main sort of area that is really uh, can affect um, a client, and 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 just sort of describe why they do what they do. Um, for example. Um, you know, it can be a, have have a, a large effect on uh, certain hormones such as adrenaline, um, and therefore like the neurotransmitters, um, and also which can which can affect how we react to stress. Um, and I and the whole whole um, reason for doing the mind mapping is to try and um, release the brakes to prevent further damage. Um, try and release the, the stress or what's causing all of this, the threat, um, so that then we can then be, be more successful in different areas of our lives, whether it's, you know, weight loss, whether it's business, uh, whether it's, you know, within the mind, um, the hormones, the digestive system, illness, pain. So it's all about understanding at a deeper level uh, what's going on with an indiv individual um, to then break it back down and map, create a map to sort of, for themselves to discover and go along and work out what's going on. Um, this is done through private, semi-private coaching programs, 90-day intensive coaching, and also um, overseas residential retreats, which look awesome. Um, the company's beliefs, well, I guess it's all about a journey. Um, so doing, starting with doing something you love um, at the end of the day, and if you're not, then you're on the wrong path. Um, it's really important to uh, be on the right map. Um, and, and that is only created by, you know, yourself um, and, and looking at where you are at that time and making that map fit your life um, and not trying to fit your life to the map that you've created. Um, it's all about going at the right pace as well um, and planning. Um, fail to plan, plan to fail. Um, so it's all about, you know, reconstructing um, all of this, in you know, into a map. So... Working the Dax Fit work with uh, um, both coaching clients and coaching coaches, uh, world class. So um, the the you know the, the and the reason for for um, doing this as a profession is to focus um, particularly within the client area on the issues um, that these clients may have, but going right to the source of the the reason, so right into the um, brain, past the central nervous system, um, into the sensory systems to create a map um, and therefore to, to sort of create a safety net um, which means that as a human being you then have the ability to predict the immediate future um, and, and therefore create appropriate responses to the environment. So it's 
it's a case of going in deeper, delving deeper into the body systems such as the proprioceptor system and uh, working out, you know, what, what is causing um, the threat and the fight, flight and freeze response um, and, and really understanding that and creating maps to sort of deal with these issues. Um, so that's sort of it from now. It's over five minutes nearly, so I better go. Um, and uh, thank you very much.